The vinifera grapes that we're cultivating here in the Finger Lakes region for the quality of the wine that is produced from them, they're not particularly resistant to cold. And so we're trying to understand the mechanisms underlying this cold resistance so that we can perhaps breed better grapes or come up with management practices to increase their cold resistance. I'm collecting buds from these grapes to extract RNA from them and see what genes are being expressed at a certain time and understand exactly how ice forms inside the buds during the winter. Al came to us a couple years ago saying he wanted to look inside of these grape buds and there was this technique called phase contrast imaging because we've been doing topography with it to study diamonds. And so I invited him to come and try it out and it actually worked. At CHES, we're able to use x-rays and actually see inside the bud without disrupting the structure. With this, we're able to actually look for ice inside the bud and look for damage from that ice. You see, you have this bud and it's only a millimeter or two in size and inside of that bud is the grape leaves and everything that's gonna eventually in the springtime come out and, and form a grape vine or a leaf with a cluster of grapes on it. So when we did our imaging, we we could see that there was a lot in there, but we couldn't really unravel what it all was. We decided we were gonna to do tomography. Tomography is CAT scanning, basically. What we do instead is we align the sample on a rotation axis, and we rotate it around 360 degrees, and we take images. And you can then reconstruct the three-dimensional volume out of all those images. With the material we collected from the last round at CHESS, we're hoping that we're going to be able to see where the ice is starting to spread from and um, how this is affecting the cold resistance of these buds.